The next step is to add your SSH key to your GitHub account. So here I am logged into my GitHub account and all the way up in the upper right hand corner, you'll see a picture of yourself. If you click on that and then go down to settings, one of the settings down here is SSH and GPG keys. You're going to click on that. And then up here, you're going to click on new SSH key. You're going to give it whatever title you want. This is just a descriptive label. I'm going to put in NSS key for now. Now, the contents of your key is going to go into this box, and I will show you how to do that. So back in the terminal, you will see I am in my SSH directory. So again, to get to that, you can just hit CD, enter to get back to your home directory, then CD.SSH to get back into that. The next thing you're going to do is type in this command, cat, which is a command in the terminal that prints the contents of a file. And then you're going to put in ID underscore RSA dot pub. This is your public key. And this is what you're going to put in GitHub. And if I enter, and you'll take the entire contents that it output here, not your command, but from this is SSH RSA. You're going to highlight all of that and you're going to copy it. And then you go back to GitHub and paste it into here and add your SSH key. It might prompt you for your password, so I'll type mine in. There you go. And I'll scroll down, and you will see an entry like this. Okay, And that is how you add your SSH key to your GitHub account so that when you are pushing and pulling code with your teammates, um, it knows who you are, and it authenticates you. That's the whole purpose of that.